Skip Schobeck is constantly surrounded by clocks, buying, selling, and fixing the time-telling instruments. He has around 500 in his inventory, and twice a year, he has to wind some by hand when daylight saving comes around. In the fall, stop them and let them catch, stop for an hour and then restart them. And then the spring's easier because you can just set the time ahead one hour. But a new bill proposed in Montpelier could make this chore a thing of the past. The legislation calls for placing Vermont on U.S. Eastern Daylight Saving Time year-round. Schobeck says the plan has its pros and cons. I mean, it would still be dark till 8 in the morning, but it would be light till 8 at night, so that's, you know. Longer daylight and evenings usually better. Farmers have also struggled with the time change too when it comes to milking cows. You got to schedule your cows going to be milked at the same time every day. Secretary of Agriculture Anson Tebbit says cows like a routine. I have known farmers that gradually lead up to this. They change their milking practices maybe 15 minutes every day and they, they try to change it. The bill has been sent to the House General Committee. Even if it's eventually approved, Congress would have the final say. You no know, one ever have to worry about adjusting the clocks to you know, be on the right time. They'd just wind them and keep them going. But no matter what happens, time will keep on ticking. And Randolph, Matt Layton, NBC5 News. <laughs>